Well, the threat of rain today did not keep people from heading down to Headwaters Park for a Fort Wayne Fe Pride Festival. News Channel 15's Aaron Rodgers has more tonight in Studio 15. Pride Fest has been around for 18 years now, but organizers say this year more people are coming out. In fact, attendance for the first day was double what it was last year. People packed Headwaters Park Pavilion for the 2014 Pride Fest. Other than people being able to enjoy music and vendors, there was also free HIV testing. Organizers say the festival is an important way to raise awareness for gay rights. They especially say after the roller coaster of a year it's been for gay rights in Indiana. But to show their support, more than a thousand people marched through the streets of downtown Fort Wayne this morning. Event organizers say it's an event that grows every year. It's just to show, you know, we're not alone. Um, a lot of the people who came out were family, straight family members of people who are gay. Um, showing, you know, that not everyone is intolerant. Um, it, it shows, you know, we're fun, we have fun, we, um, we're real, and we're here. Pride Fest wraps up around midnight tonight and ends with the most popular event, the drag show. Organizers are expecting around seven or 8,000 people to come out. Tonight on Nightcast, hear why allies and LGBTQ community members think this event is so crucial for the community. In Studio 15 tonight, Aaron Rodgers, News Channel 15.